Hello, this is Mike Ginevro, and welcome back to this series of videos on basic project management vocabulary, a basic project management uh, glossary. And uh, again, here's a list of the overall set of terms that we're going to be looking at in these videos. And in this particular video, we're going to look at the term project management. Okay, now, what I'm going to do first is read the definition that I put together and then comment a little bit more on the term. Um, again, this will be a maximum of five minutes long, so I'm just going to be getting into some of the basics. And we're going to cover the other terms um, in more detail as we go through this process, this series of videos. So now let's look at the uh, definition of project management. Project management is the science and art of getting things done through people. Science, art, people. These are the three dimensions of project management. And that's the term I'm going to use uh, throughout these videos, the, term, the terminology. Three dimensions of project management, science, art, and the human dimension or the people dimension. When most of us think about project management, actually we focus on the tools of project management, the project plan, the project charter, schedule, budget, resource allocation, the much loved Gantt chart. These tools reflect the scientific, rational, left brain dimension of project management. However, project management is also an art. In this artistic, intuitive, right brain dimension, the project manager is the conductor of a symphony. At our best as project managers, we become one of the become one of the symphonic harmonies of the team, and our projects become the music of our lives and then of the lives of our fellow artists in the world of getting things done. By their very nature, projects are not the work of an isolated scientist or engineer. Projects are the work of a, of a, are not the work of a soaring soloist. Projects are the work of teams of collections of individuals who at their best dedicate their individual talents to the shared goals and objectives of the team of the project. For all our sophisticated tools and mathematical models, for all the subtlety of our in artistic intuition, we in project management find success and fulfillment through the often tireless efforts and dedication of people. And ultimately, the human dimension of project management is fundamental we get things done through people. So this notion that there is a rational, scientific, logical aspect to project management that's embodied in the tools that we'll be looking at in many of these videos. There is also an intuitive or artistic sense to project management, a feel, a gut feel, that becomes really important in pulling together all the different pieces that are occurring in a project, of being able to see things whole, to see things holistically. Um, the world, words of the 19th century Victorians, to see things steadily and to see them whole. Um, that artistic dimension is uh, one of the most subtle and, and, and most difficult to describe, but it is real in project management and in other endeavors. Finally, people. People, people, people. We get things done through people. We get things done ultimately through the cooperation and the dedication and, of, of people across organizations, across functions, and that people dimension is absolutely fundamental in project management. So we're looking at three dimensions, science, art, and people. Now we'll go on to look at some of the other uh, pieces of this basic glossary, this basic um, vocabulary for project management. 